Boys and girls have different parts. What is your problem right? anyway? So, I'm the officer's daughter, so what? That like, I get any kind of special treatment. Revelation 21.6. I am Alpha. Ugh. Why is it always so bright in this vault? Hello. As far as I can tell, you're a perfectly healthy 16-year-old boy. What? So yes, you have to go to class to take your goat exam. Oh, come on. Go on now. You've got a goat to take. I've got a what? Is there anything I should know about this thing? A test? A generalized occupational aptitude test. Goat. Everyone here in the vault takes it when they're 16. Helps to figure out what sort of a job you'll have here in Vault 101 when you get a bit older. So, pay attention and try not to fall asleep. You know what the Overseer says? We are born in the Vault, we die in the Vault. Each is tested to determine their abilities that they may work for the betterment of all Vault residents. Huh. Sound familiar? Very. Okay, well. Do we have to die in the Vault? I'd, I'd rather, like... You know, see the sun at some point? That's not the way it works. And it won't do to go around asking questions like that. Especially not around the Overseer. I want to tell you something now. It's important, so listen closely. This place, this vault, it's not perfect, I know. But it is your home. You're safe here. Stay on the Overseer's good side, and you always will be. You understand? You need to appreciate all you have. Because what's up there, on the outside, that's not the life I want for you. And it's not what your mother wanted for you either. How come we don't ever talk about Mom? Was everyone born in the vault ever? Where do babies come? Okay, how was Babby formed? Alright, bye, Dad. Take care, son. Now get out of here, and good luck. I don't want to take the test. I feel sick. I'm going to knock your hot plate on the floor. Ugh. How do you like that? And I'm going to knock your... Fan over if I can. Yeah, mm. I'm gonna steal your bobblehead. What? You found a Vault Tech limited edition bobblehead. The inscription on the base reads The smart man knows a bandage only hides his wounds. Your medicine skill has been permanently increased by 10 points. Ooh! Teenage Rebellion pays off, man. I should punch somebody next. Jonas! Stop Perfect! The man Just the man I wanted day. to see. <laughs> Okay, what's going on? Hey, this is great with my voice messing up this much. It sounds like I'm a teenager with going through puberty, just like uh, cracking way, and things. Tunnel snakes. What's going on here? I can show you a real tunnel snake, Amada. God, Bush. Ew, what? You just leave me Dude, alone? that's nasty. Don't talk like that. Stupid tunnel snakes. Immature assholes, if you ask me. Why won't they leave me alone? It's not my fault my father's the overseer. I don't care about their stupid gang. Can you talk to them? Maybe Butch will listen to you. Please? I don't see why he'd listen to me, but I'll see if I can talk to him. Thanks. You've always been a good friend. Try talking to Butch. They'll all do whatever he says. Huh. She's nothing, Butch. Hey, Butch. Yeah? What do you want? I'd like for you to leave this person alone. What is going on here? None of your business, kid. Get out of here before you get hurt. Kid, we're the same if age, If you mess punk. with the tunnel snakes, you're asking for it. Got me? I'll beat you all up, punk. Besides, if you keep messing with her, the overseer is gonna come down hard on your gang. Maybe you're right. We can deal with her later. Show it to her. Come on, tunnel yeah. snakes. This little bitch isn't worth our time. You just walk away, punk. Whatever you say, Butch. You're the boss. Tunnel snakes rule. Fine. Let's Jeez. go. You're welcome. Thanks for getting rid of them. Tch, assholes. I don't know why they won't leave me alone. Just because my father's the overseer, I guess? Idiots. I know. I mean, certainly not the reason I hate you. What's this on the wall over here? America lives on in you. Seek the sunshine of friendship. Ooh, we're all in this together. Hard work is happy work. Wow, this is some serious brainwashing. Have you taken your medication today? Holy crap! <laughs> well, you made it. All set for the goat. Trust me, it really isn't that bad. Just something everybody has to go through. Yeah, like puberty. Uh, I don't know, Mr. B, I feel kind of sick. Didn't work on your dad either, did it? Now, unless you have something else you want to discuss, take a seat and prepare for the 2274 edition of The Goat. Oh my god, is that what year it is? 
All right, I'm ready. I'm sure you will, especially since it's multiple choice with no wrong answers. We'll start as soon as everyone's found a seat. Good luck. All right. I guess there's only like one. Where's my I've seat? I'll sit in the front so I can see the board really well. Oh yeah. My, my, my perception's only five. I don't have the best vision. Yeah, take a, take a seat, dude. Come on. Time for the test. Well, now that everyone has managed to find the classroom, we can finally get started. No talking. And keep your eyes to yourselves. Yes, I'm talking to you, Mr. Deloria. Ugh. Unless anyone else has an insightful comment, let's get started. Question one. A frenzied vault scientist runs up to you and yells... I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber. Oh, God. What's your response? <laughs> What's going in my eyes? <laughs> but, Doctor, wouldn't that cause a parabolic destabilization of the fission singularity? <laughs> uh, yeah, you can, you can girly go any way you want with these. It doesn't actually matter. It's sort of like answering the questions to the guy at the beginning in the excise office in Morrowind. Your answers will make them guess at what you'd like to do in the game, but you can always choose to do something else later. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Up yours, buddy! No, I'm gonna use the smart response. Question two. While working as an intern in the clinic, a patient with a strange infection in his foot stumbles through the door. The infection is spreading at an alarming rate, but the doctor has stepped out for a while. What do you do? Call the doctor back. Oh, how does an option? That isn't an option. Let's see. Restrain the patient and merely observe as the infection spreads. That sounds like the wrong answer. Medicate the infected area. Scream for help! Oh, God! I'm just going to medicate the area. Question three. You discover a young boy lost in the lower levels of the vault. He's hungry and frightened, but also appears to be in possession of stolen property. What do you do? <laughs> hey, Georgie. You want a balloon? <laughs> Confiscate the stolen property by force and leave the boy there as punishment. Oh my. Pick the boy's property to take it for. <laughs> oh, lead him to safety and turn him in. Question four. Lawful good. Congratulations. You've made one of the Vault 101 baseball teams. Which position do you prefer? Uh, <laughs> I gotta say, in this debate, I'm definitely the pitcher. Question five. Your grandmother invites you to tea, but you're surprised when she gives you a pistol and orders you to kill another vault resident. What the hell, Granny? What do you do? You're crazy. Ask Granny for a minigun instead. <laughs> Throw your tea in Granny's face. I never understood that answer. It's like one of these is just like for each question, there's always the chaotic evil answer, or you're just a, just a dickhead for no reason. <laughs> Okay, um, uh, I don't know what to do. I mean, honestly, though, if you want to actually say what your character would do in a Fallout situation, you would actually take the quest and go kill the guy. Question six. Old Mr. Abernathy has locked himself in his quarters again, and you've been ordered to get him out. How do you proceed? Um, I don't know. I can tell him he's missing an NBC News announcement or something. Walk away and look old cute rot. Get a laser pistol and shoot the lock off. Uh, actually, that works. Question seven. Oh no, you've been exposed to radiation. Oh no! And a mutated hand has grown out of your stomach. What's the best course of treatment? Lots and lots of juggling. Uh, I mean, removal of the mutated tissue with a precision laser. Question eight. A fellow Vault 101 resident is in possession of a Grognak the Barbarian comic book. Issue number one. You want it. What's the best way to obtain it? Kill him and take it. Oh, um... Yeah, I could, um... I could knock him out and take it while he's unconscious. Sneak in and steal it from him. Or I could just trade it. I don't know. Uh, I'd probably sneak in and take it, honestly. Question nine. You decide it would be fun to play a prank on your father. You enter his private restroom when no one is looking, and... Manipulate the power wads on his razor so he'll get an electric shock next time he shaves. Replace the medicine cabinet, uh, the blood pressure medication, with sugar pills. There's your chaotic evil answer. 
<laughs> uh, put a firecracker in the toilet. Oh God! Uh, let's just loosen the pipes. Question ten: Who is indisputably the most important person in Vault 101? Ooh, I know this he one. who shelters us from the harshness of the atomic wasteland, and to whom we owe everything we have, including our lives. Poncho. Oh wait. Crap. Which one is it? Well, I've always said if you don't know, go with C. Pencils down, people. That's it. The infamous goat. Ooh. I'm sure most of you didn't find it so bad. Others, well, there are always openings in the maintenance department. What? Don't forget to hand in your test before you leave. You don't want to know what happens to people who fail the goat. You can have the rest of the day off to celebrate or to pray, as the situation warrants. Let's get out of this desk. Now, what's funny is he goes and sits at his desk, and if you watch, other characters will walk up and hand in their tests, and you can learn a little bit about the other mall residents. It's kind of funny. I think they might be waiting. No, they're not waiting for me. All right, go on. Go on, turn your test in. So here comes Amada. She's first. Here you are, Mr. Brach. I hope I did okay. Nothing for you to worry about, Miss Almodovar. Let's see. Very well done. Looks like it's the supervisory track for you. Thanks. See you tomorrow. Hmm, wow. Miss Butch? Yo, teach. I'm done. Ah, Butch. Can I admit that I've been waiting for this day for a long, long time? Allow me to savor the moment. Now then, let's see. Hmm. Really? Interesting. You surprised me, Butch. I didn't think you had it in you. Hairdresser. What? Ooh, what a thunk. Not me. You're so full of it. That is <laughs> true. That's hilarious. Uh, Alright, that's enough for me. It's nice to know I can still be surprised. Pedicurist. What? I might have guessed manicurist. Or even masseuse. But apparently, you're a foot person. Ew. That's not me at all, man. That's 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 totally crazy. Uh <laughs> Whatever, I just answered randomly. Is that how you got stuck with your job? Ha! Closer to reality than you might think. Listen, I was just as obnoxious at your age. I didn't take the goat seriously. And look where I ended up. Just between you and me. The whole test is a joke. If you don't like the results, I can make your goat come out any way you want. Just let me know. <laughs> yeah, this is it right here. There's another achievement. The Goat Whisperer. Just take the goat. That's all there is. All right. So they guessed for me uh, pretty accurately, actually. I don't know where they got explosives since I didn't answer any of the explosive options. So we don't want explosives. Energy weapons. That's that's great. Um, but not for this game. If we ever do a, a Fall of New Vegas LP, I will play an energy weapons character. But in this game, I have to play small guns. That's just that's how I roll. So let's see. Uh, actually, the right right at the beginning though, it's sort of a uh, eh. it's, tr it's a tricky thing here. Uh, let's see. We want so if you want medicine repair and small guns, this is going to make you a very survivable kind of character. You're not going to have a hard time at all persisting in the wasteland because you'll be able to take care of yourself with the medicine stat. You get more bonuses from stim packs and other things you find. Uh, repair allows you to take care of your gear, and small guns lets you shoot stuff with guns. So, all and small guns is all the way up to like the shotguns and things. So, it isn't just pistols. Uh, up here you have big guns. That's where you have Gatling lasers and mini guns and missile launchers and such. And then explosives is just grenades and mines and such. So, it's not this. This is actually a good one to pick. Uh, medicine. See, it's already at 31 because I found the bobblehead, so I don't really know if I need to tag that. I might be better off to put it in lockpicking, just to get that skill up to 25. Alright. I'm all done, Mr. Brotch. Yeah, I'm gonna head out of here. Alright! Because basically, your lockpicking skill is determined by like, every 25th point. So you get, you get to unlock and do more kinds of locks. You need to know these Wake up! Come on, wake up! Why is it so damn bright in here all the time? Uh, how's it going, Amada? Come on! You've got to wake up! Man, you know, I was just dreaming about you. Don't be a smart mouth! This is serious! Oh, sorry. My father's men are looking for you. They've already killed Jonas. What? You've got to get out of here! How, what the hell happened to Jonas? 
It's your dad. He's left the vault. My father thinks Jonas helped him escape. So he had his men. My God, they killed him. They just beat him and beat him and wouldn't stop. What the hell? Are you okay, Mata? Yeah, don't worry about me. I'm just sorry you had to find out like this. I know Jonas was your friend. The best! But we've got to go now. My father's men will be here any minute. Oh, God. But how did he even get out? The door's sealed. Not anymore, apparently. But are you honestly telling me you had no idea your dad was leaving? He really didn't tell you? No. Oh, I'm sorry. I I'm sure he had his reasons. Maybe Jonas was supposed to explain everything to you? Well, that didn't work out. But it doesn't matter. I can help you escape. I have my own plan. You have actually... Oh, boy. I don't have time to explain everything. You're just going to have to trust me this time. Listen, there's a secret tunnel that leads directly from my father's office to the exit. You'll have to hack the computer in his office to open it. Okay. Use these to get into his office. That's how I always get in. Oh, bobby pins. Why can't I just got the front door? My father's not stupid. He sealed the door to the exit to prevent anyone else from escaping. Oh, boy. The tunnel is the only way out. You're just going to have to trust me. Fine, oh, plot device. I stole my father's pistol. I hope you won't need it, but you'd better take it just in case. Oh, God. I only use it if I have to. Okay, I'll try to meet you at the exit. Watch out for security. Good luck. I don't know how to use a pistol. I barely handled a BB gun without shooting my dad in the ass. I'll meet you at the vault door if I can, but don't wait for me. All right, all right, all right, let's... I think you get a little checkpoint here if you try to walk out. You should get stuff from your desk before you leave. Yeah, okay. BB gun, BBs, a baseball, a baseball glove, and my bat, which is actually a melee weapon. First aid kit, med packs, uh, med kit stim packs. I don't have any weapons here, so let's get, uh, let's get the bat out, shall we? Just because there's not very many dangerous things in this vault, so. There he is. Hold it right there. Oh God, security. Jeez. Ooh, how do I get out of here? I'm gonna sneak away from this guy. Sorry, dude. It's not my fault. You gotta help me! My mom's trapped in there with the rat roaches! What do you want me to do? God, if you only knew what the word irony means. Yeah, I'm asking you. So what? Look, I'm sorry for the way I've always treated you. You know I never meant any of it, right? Bullshit. But it's my mom. You can't leave her in there with the rad roaches. Why don't you go in and kill them? Seriously. Well, yeah, so I hate rad roaches. So what? I tried to go back in to help her. I swear I did. But I just can't do it. So I'm begging you, please help her. I don't know what I'd do without my mom. Right. <laughs> oh my god. Your mom's already done for. You better run before those roaches come for you, boy. Just go back in and squish them. Be a hero. No. Oh, fine. I'll do it. Oh, my God. Thank you. I didn't know what to do. You're the best. You're an asshole. Get out of my way. Dun -dun 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 Saving the day. Oh, my God. Well, that was hard. Jeez. We did it! My mom's gonna be okay. You're the best friend I've ever had, man. Boy, are you fickle. Hey, I know it isn't much, but I want you to have my Tunnel Snake's jacket. Go ahead, take it. Oh, thanks. Now I'm part of a gang. Are you alright, miss? Where did those... I need another drink. Yep, alrighty. Uh, let's see. Wait a minute. Which way am I walking here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, uh, back this way here. I want to get out yeah, to the diner. Is this right? Reactor level? Oh, God. Rad roaches. Oh! oh. Curse smack! Watch out! Oh, God. They killed Grandma Taylor. Let's take your clothes. Watch out! Oh, you can still see the, sm the stain from where my cake was. Eh, not really. Hey, is the intercom gone from the wall? That's weird. Where did it go? Oh, wow. I never noticed that before. The intercom's gone. Doesn't seem to be around here either. How strange. Alright, well, I guess we want to go up to the atrium to get out of here, right? Uh, it's the only thing I guess. Where do they keep oh, God. From? Who's this guy? Oh, it's Gomez. Oh, you're lucky it was me who found you. The others won't be so forgiving. I don't know what you're up to, and I, I don't want to know. Just, just clear out of here, and I'll pretend I never saw you. Thanks, Gomez. 
<laughs> I'll pretend you don't work for a homicidal maniac. Don't think I don't know it. Why do you think I'm letting you go? I guess you're trying to follow your dad. Outside. Good gravy. If I didn't know what the overseer would do if he caught you, I'd never tell you to try for it. But it's your only shot. And you take care, and I hope you find your daddy. Daddy? You know I'm like 19 now, right? Criminy! <laughs> oh, jeez. Is that the cake bot? Using a flamethrower? Jesus. Alright, well, take this to the classroom there. Wait a minute, that means that the med lab is right back here. Maybe Dad left something for me. You're the one everybody's looking for. Oh, jeez, this place is a mess. I don't think there's anything for us to find here. Let's get out of this place. Jeez, the overseer is just gone crazy. He's killing, he killed Jonas. You can't do that, man. You can't introduce a character early in the game for the express purpose of killing them ten minutes later. Even though that seems to happen all the time in video games. It's our only chance, don't you see? We're getting out of here, just like the doctor. I'm not gonna let anyone stop us. Yeah, Tom, you tell him. Go, Tom, go. Tom, hold. I've got a live one. Oh God, I'm not going that way. <laughs> oh jeez, criminy! More roaches! Get out of here! Yeah, they're not—they're not a threat at all. Even at level one, they're just a single smack with the bat. Watcha! Where the heck am I supposed to go? Hey, screw off, dude! Whoa, big line going across my screen. Can y'all see that? Is that showing up in recording? No, it's just on my screen. Oh, very strange. Oh, jeez. Ah, get out of here. Watch yeah. out! Whoops, I missed. Oh, ow! Jeez, bit me. I mean, they are poisonous or something. Let's keep moving here. Oh, what the hell's going on there? They got they have a mata. Hey, the hell do you think you're doing? Oh, I'll make you pay for this. Wow, I'm not very good at this. With a baseball bat. Ah. You know what? I have a gun. I think it's time to use it. Actually, that's the BB gun. What am I doing? Eh, whatever. Let's kill him with a BB gun. <laughs> fun. This thing doesn't reload very fast, does it? Oh, I crippled his head! That's gotta hurt. Oh, there's two of them now. Crap. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Damn. This guy that's moving around. This hand guy doesn't usually run in on you. Yeah, that's what a kill usually looks like in vats. Their head goes flying off or something. Just goes nuts. Ugh. What the God, hell do you think help. you're doing? I hope you're here to turn yourself in, young man. You're already in enough trouble as it is. Don't make it worse for yourself. Excuse me, you're the one who's killing people. Give me the key to your office. I'm out of here. Oh, is that all? Is there anything else I can get you while you I swear I'll kill you. You'll get nothing from me. I'll die before I see the safety of the vault compromised. Then I'll kill you like I killed a lot! You're right. <laughs> you will die if you don't give me that password. I've dealt with your kind before, you little snot nosed punk. You should have run like your coward of a father. Excuse me, what? Got you now. I don't have time for this. I'll find my own way in. After raiding your guards of their armor. Goodbye. Let's get out of here. Overseer's office is this way. 